The Urban Renewal 2.0 program has transformed several inner city youth with no musical experience into competent musicians. The band has literally become a staple in the community, and last week the Urban Renewal concert band made its debut at Government House. Our Altavis Munnings has their story. You may have probably seen them at a special event you've attended. The very popular Urban Renewal Band has been the talk of the town. At the recent Urban Renewal Foundation launch though, the Urban Renewal Concert Band performed for the first time at Government House. A task band coordinator Sergeant Theodore Campbell admits wasn't easy. It was extremely challenging because of the time frame, but these young persons are extremely talented. And I just hope the country is extremely proud of what they're doing through the mechanism of music. Band participation teaches these young musicians all about discipline, and urban renewal officials maintain it keeps them academically focused and off the streets. These young persons were extremely proud to be chosen, extremely proud to represent their country, represent the government, represent the Royal Bahamas Police Force, represent their family, represent themselves, but most of all, represent God. These young musicians between the ages of 7 and 17 have learned how to play a variety of wind and percussion instruments. And if you've seen them play, they truly love it. To give them the tools necessary to succeed in the very near future, whether it's a scholarship opportunity or a job opportunity, police force, defense force, prison, or even now you have the Bahama Development opening in 2014, they could be a part of the entertainment section. So, so many opportunities available for these young persons. Altavis Munnings, ZNS Network News.